Hey guys, just a short video to share my newest toy here. It's called a Magician Chassis from Sparkfun. It's basically these two pieces of plastic, all the hardware, the standoffs, the screws comes with it. It comes with the wheels, it comes with the, uh, the motor down there, two motors, and a caster, um, and the battery holder down here for the motor. So the only thing that come, doesn't come with it are this, of course the Arduino does not come with it for $15, you don't get an Arduino. Um, here's a 9 volt battery here that I put, also didn't come with it. And of course the breadboard and the H bridge that is needed to drive the motor because the Arduino is not powerful enough to drive those, the motor down there. So before we go any further, let's uh, see it run. Let's see, I think it goes forward this way. So I have two switches. I have a switch here for the power to the to the motor because I, when I'm playing with a code, I didn't want the motor to keep on spinning. So I have a switch there to to kind of power to the motor. And then uh, we have the Arduino switch right here to to give power to the Arduino. And what it's going to do is basically going to make a kind of like a square and comes right back where we started. So so you go forward and make a square and it should come right back to us. So it's not too bad. I mean, it's not dead accurate. It's slides, and I'm not sure really how much of that is sliding on the uh, on the surface here, on the what do you call this wood floor, <laughs> on the wood floor, and probably more than the floor itself is this right here is the problem. The caster here has a little ball bearing, but it doesn't. I don't know. It has resistance or something, but it tends to make the uh, robot not move in a straight line um, I don't know some of it probably is also the motor is cheap and it's not all that powerful but what I notice is that when it's moving one direction it drives more straight when then with moving the other direction so let me uh, turn this off and then I have this little s selector here that changes the program inside so instead of going uh, turn around in a, in a circle and a square it's just gonna go back and forth let's see which direction is it gonna go first we'll just try it turn on power to the motor turn on power to the Arduino and we'll see which, which way it goes oops I got it backward okay so I'm gonna let it go so that's fairly straight but let's see how much that turned so that's straight and it just turns on the other direction either even though the motor is actually moving the same distance it's just going changing directions so one direction that's straight and it looks like whenever the caster is on the back trailing behind it ends up turning the whole uh, robot but I guess uh, that's what you get for $15 but all in all, I'm pretty happy with it. I think that that's probably solvable. Maybe I'll put something better to, to uh, create less resistance there. The motor isn't all that strong, but it's strong enough to move around on the uh, wood floor. So that's about it, guys. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.